<clears throat> Welcome everyone, I'm your host, Ultimate Mayu420, and we are gonna be continuing our blind run of Resident Evil HD, baby. Oh yeah, it's been a long time since I've played this. Okay, so here we go. We're just about to get started. Sorry for the initial delay in setting the stream up and getting the stream up and running, but you know technicalities have to be dealt with in the computer world all right so let's see who we got on the stream at the moment all right people still joining not a problem so let's load our game and get the show on the road baby where were we now resident storeroom Fight your fears and survive. I will try. Alright, let's see what we have on us here. We've got to put this ink ribbon away. I still got to find this con this control room, man. Don't know what that red book is used for, so, you know, we'll leave it for now. I wonder if there's a way to get this map without the bees coming out. Yeah. Hang on a minute. There seems to be a ladder here, on the map. What? There's a ladder here. Oh, you can push this now, can you? see what's down here man so maybe this is where I've been needing to go all this time all right what's happening over here shit man this place looks gloomy reminds me of Resident Evil 2 oh boy that don't sound nice it's locked from the other side. Oh, you can push these, huh? Now, where would I push these to? Okay, makes sense. I mean, you don't really expect him to swim in there now, do you? Oh, come on, bro. What's going on? Okay. At least we're making some progress now.
Mm -hmm. Green plant. I will take this. Oh shit. I have a bad feeling about this room, boy. Especially reading about that document about plant 42. Richard. Chris! Chris, stop! No! Shit, he got wrecked. Richard. Hey, man. What the hell? Where did these sharkies come from? And Dr. Pepper. What's going on, Dr. Pepper, man? How are you doing, my brother? And we have Tiffany Richardson. Welcome, Tiffany Richardson. Not seen you in the stream before. Welcome to the stream. What time zone are you from? And I'm playing on PC, my friend. I'm playing on PC here. Uh, this is a blind run. I've not played this game before. Oh, my... Did I just get eaten? Oh my gosh. Shit. You use the control room key, so this is the control room. Oh my gosh. Let's get in here. A zombie jaws. <laughs> you said it, man. So this is the room that I was looking for at all last stream. Like, towards the latter half of my last stream of this game. For a whole hour I was looking for this room, like, the control room. So, let's see what's in here now. The aqua ring. Come on, there's got to be something more, more sophisticated in here than this. A wonderful quality. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I strive very hard to ensure that my stream quality is always the best. I take you've played this game before, Tiffany. All right. An error message is being displayed. Something appears to have gone wrong while the water was being drained. There's a switch to drain the water. Press it. Not yet. What's the same message? A pressure shelter. I have a bad feeling about this, man. I have a real bad feeling about this. There's a map of the Aqua Ring. Take it, of course. You got the map of the Aqua Ring. Alright, nice. Hmm, first aid kit. Mine, baby. Oh, yeah. An oil pressure regulator. There's no need to adjust the pressure right now. You've played every Resident Evil? Sweet, man. Uh, this game I played on the GameCube, but um, I, I only got as far as the four masks, and then I lost my save file, never played it, and that was like 10 plus years ago. So now I have it on PC, I'm now actually um, running through the whole game, and this is the furthest I've ever been in this particular game. And so, yeah, I'm looking to complete the game now for the first time. Uh, I've completed Resident Evil 2, I've completed Resident Evil 3, both of those on the Dreamcast. I played half of Code Veronica, and that's pretty much it. So Code Veronica is also a blind game that I'm going to be doing at some stage. Alright, here we go. The controls for the main system. Everything seems to be in proper working order. Well, that's good, isn't it? What's under here? Alright. Looks like I have to drain it then. Let's drain the water. Uh oh. Critical. Unknown source of pressure detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. To achieve maximum safety? Look at the glass. Them sharks are going to come in here anytime soon. Uh oh. What do I do? 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 There's a control lever for the pressure shelter, but it won't budge until the safety is released. Of Cannot resume drainage. Oh my gosh. There's a pressure somewhere, somewhere here. It was here, wasn't it? An oil pressure regulator. There's no need to adjust the pressure right. What do you mean there's no need to adjust the pressure right now? 
Alright, let's go down here. The door is held tightly shut by the pressure of the water. Great. <laughs> Poor sharks. <laughs> Poor me, man. I'm about to, about to get eaten by them. And many thanks, Tiffany Richardson, for the follow. Much appreciated. What do I do? Maybe I'll go back up here. Critical 50%. Oh my gosh. The warning lamp indicates that there's an emergency. I'm gonna mess this up, aren't I? The door appears to be locked by some sort of safety mechanism. Better release the safety mechanism first. Are we serious? Reaching we ain't gonna make it. Of Do something, man. Release the safety. Yes, the safety mechanism for the pressure shelter has been released. Open the door. Open the door! Oh my gosh. The door is held tightly shut. The sharkies are gonna bust in here. The sharkies are gonna bust in here. Reaching maximum pressure threshold. Crap. Oh, you got to be kidding me, man. <sighs> and just as, as soon as I started to, to make wind of what I was supposed to do, like... <laughs> I, did, I did use the uh, control panel in the end, but I didn't, I didn't use it in time. So, Alright, here we go, now we got to... Backtrack. There's a lot of backtracking in this game. You have to lower the pressure. Okay. Them sharks do not do not look friendly at all, boy. I must say. I get the feeling I should burn this zombie on the floor here, man. Alright, here we go. Push this through. There's a ladder. Down the ladder we go. Into the shark's den. Now this part's tedious, man. So Tiffany, which time zone are you from? And w which version of the game do you play? Do you play the PC version or do you play console version?
any time now. There we go. Console version, you're from California. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I'm assuming you play the PS4 version. Richard! What is he doing down here anyway? Chris! Chris, stop! No! You got wrecked, boy. Richard. Alright, run, 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 run. These guys don't look friendly. Oh, you play, you, you play on the Xbox instead. Ouch! Ooh, 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 that was close, boy. Control room key, let's discard that, get in there. Ooh. Ooh, that was close. Alright. Take this map. Caution in case of a drop in oil pr pressure, open valve 3. Alright, let me read that again. That's probably the valve I need to open. Caution. In case of a drop in oil pressure, control, open valve 3. Alright. A pressure shelter. Now here goes nothing. Ugh. Emergency. Those Unknown teeth. Source of pressure detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. The safety mechanism for the pressure shelter has been released. All right. This is not the time. <laughs> Oil pressure regulator. There's no need to adjust the pressure right now. Are you serious? There's a control lever for the pressure shelter. Pull it, of course. Oil pressure lost. Shelter operation terminated. Restore oil pressure, then release the safety. The switches control the oil pressure valves. Press switch switch. Press switch 3. We won't budge until the safety is released. Again, the safety. Ah, phew. Water has been completely drained. Nice. Yeah, I've done it, my brother. I've done it. <laughs> I've done it. Yay. Okay, now I'm nervous now. Should I go back upstairs? How many floors has this place got? Acquiring B1, B2. So, B1... Let's see. So if the water's, if the water's drained, the shark should not be upstairs no more, right? So if I go here, everything seems to be back to normal now. Okay.
Oh, 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 shit. <laughs> Can they still eat you? What's in here? Uh, whoa. What the hell was that, man? Let me guess, that was plant 42, right? Holy crap. <laughs> okay. So there seems to be... There was a door here, right? I remember seeing a door on the map. Okay, so we've been in there. So now we have to go down. Now down the ladder we go. And Mr. RC29, what's going on, my brother? How are you, man? Pleasure to see you back in the stream. How's everything? I'm still wrestling with this game here. Okay, I'm nervous about going outside here. I think the sharks are still waiting. Okay, let's see. I've got two choices. I could go either right or left. I think I'm going to go... Let me check this area out. Shotgun shells, yes please. The materials are labelled dynamite. They're soaked beyond use. Diving suits and nets. There doesn't seem to be anything of use. Okay, which way shall I go? Yeah, the sharky. Oh, look, there's another sharky. This is bad. The water flow control wait the water the water flow control system it doesn't have power. The generator unit for the water flow control system. Pull the lever down. But how are you, Mr. C? What's going on, man? What have you been up to, my brother? Oh, look, there's, there are large teeth marks in the chair. There seems to be something on the floor here. Is that a gun? Will you take the assault shotgun? Yes. An experiment monitor. Looks like it was being used to gather data on sharks. Which Resident Evil is this? This is glad to hear you're good, my brother. This is Resident Evil. This is Resident Evil HD, the the remake of the original. All right, so the only other way for me to go is this way. Tell me, there's an item box here somewhere, man, or like an item room. What is this? You can't carry any more items. Damn it. I didn't get the revolver either. My stream is so relaxing, glad to hear it, man.
The materials are packed up tightly. This place looks like a garbage dump. <laughs> My voice too? Really? Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that, man. You unlocked it. Nice. So now we can go through... Oh, wow, the water's been drained. So we can't go through there anymore. So now what do I do? Oh, the reason why the room is red is because of the um, item I left behind. That's why. But... I seem to be missing an item though. I seem to be missing business here. It doesn't look like I'm finished. What do I think about the new Resident Evil? You're talking about Resident Evil 7? I've not even played it yet. I don't even know if it's related to the original to the original um, Resident Evil series. Or if it's a game, a story of its own, in its own kind of show. So I'm thinking about playing all the, all the previous games that I haven't played and beaten before going on to Resident Evil 7. Okay, what is it about this room that I'm missing, man? Oh, maybe I just gotta turn the power on. Maybe that's what I had to do. Various types of machinery, you have no idea what they're used for. This shark seems dangerous, man. I don't like the way it's just sitting there in the water. Surprised he doesn't get a shock from that man. I'm still lost here, man. Maybe I missed something. This thing looks like it could electrocute you. The stream is live on Hitbox as well, under the same name, and is also live on Beam as well, as well, Microsoft Beam. If you guys have accounts there, consider following me there. I also have a Discord server. If you would like to join the Discord server, let me know. <laughs> Kiss Sharky, man. <laughs> Kiss Sharky. No way, man. I have no intention of being shark food, you know what I'm saying? There are large teeth marks in the chair. Okay. Why is this room red? What am I missing? I'm trying to press A around everything, but like nothing's happening, man. Because look, if you see here, the room is red. I'm missing something, man. So I've got some business in this room. Hmm.
Mm, Skittles. <laughs> Skittles. Oh boy. The control panels where there is electricity. I, I tried the control panel. But the control panel, you can't use it because it will just say, ah, oh, this is going to electrocute you. This thing looks like it could electrocute you. I pull the lever back up, the electricity goes. The water flow control system, it doesn't have power. Now I've got it power. Now I can't use it because if I touch it, I'll die. Because it's got sparks flying out of everywhere. I'm guessing the electricity needs to be on for something else though. Because it wasn't on before I came here. <clears throat> there is something on the left of the control panel. That, that was... That was the actual um, lever for the power. Will you take the magnum rounds? Yes. I still need to get the magnum actually, man. I actually missed out on the magnum earlier. Still left in the mansion. In a little cupboard, it bright, you can see. On the control panel, yeah? Alright. I'll go back down. And check it out. Because the room is still red, so we still got business there. On the left of the control panel, you will see, okay. And let me guess, if I pick up this item, right, the shark is gonna wake up. Oh, there it is, I see, I see, I see. Oh shit! The generator U unit for the water flow system. Pull the lever, no. <laughs> oh man. Got wrecked. Oh, what? What was I supposed to do there? Instant kill, man. Cutscene kill, man. Shit. I 
Well, here we go again, baby. And now I have to do all of that again. This is the one thing I, that's, that really sucks about this game, man. So much backtracking, like. Consumes a lot of time. He Now I actually have to go and put the canteen back, man. I keep going through the wrong damn door. Okay, let's see now. Because you have such limited inventory as well, man. Three hundred and sixty five days just to open a door, it's so damn long. <laughs> yeah, it does take all year to open these doors, man. I heard that there's a mod actually for the PC version where you can actually door skip. I need to look into that, man. Now you see the zombie on the floor, he's gone now, because I burnt him, so he, he won't trouble me later. He won't become crimson or anything like that. Now down the ladder we go.
You want me to tell you what the story is? Okay, the story goes like this, yeah? Um, at the beginning of the game, the, uh, the game is set in this, in this fictional city in America called Raccoon City, okay? It's a fictional city, it doesn't exist. Um, there's a... There's a superior um, police force. So, um, they have their own police department, like Raccoon City... Raccoon City Police Department, of which they have, like, an elite level of police force. And that elite level of police force is known as STARS. I'm playing as STARS member Chris here. Okay. And, um, his team is sent to investigate the disappearance... The disappearance of another... of another STARS team that was sent in to investigate, um, a cannibalism activity in this mansion. Uh, the team when the, f the previous team that was sent uh they they lost all communication with with um, the police department so this team so chris's team has now been sent in to investigate Richard. what happened to them chris chris stop no! You see, he was one of the members of the previous team that was sent beforehand. The guy that just got eaten by the shock. Now, apparently, the story goes like this. Um, some illegal experiments were happening here. With zombies and stuff. Uh, and, and this company called Umbrella, they invented the T-Virus. And they were doing illegal experiments with the T-Virus, and the T-Virus would cause... Would cause uh, mutations and weird sorts of growth and all that kind of stuff. And this is how the zombies came about. And then eventually, uh, one of the experiments went wrong, there was an accident, everyone became a zombie. And now you kind of have to find out what the hell happened. Not just to the team, but what was going on here overall. So that's the story. <laughs> the T-Virus. <laughs> no, the letter T. Yeah, yeah, haha, ha, you're gonna study hard the English the English next year, and the stream helped me a lot. <laughs> the stream helps you a lot, wicked man, wicked. I'm, all, I'm, I'm always happy to help people out, man. Right, now what do I do? Yes. The water has been drained. Wicked stuff, man. I think we are done with this room now. Shotgun shells. Mm. 
There are large teeth marks in the chair. Whoa. Okay, around here we go. Smoky Smoky Deep Sixth Haha <laughs> yeah The generator unit for the water for the water flow control system isn't is it's toasted. Alright, that's what I should have done. Will you take the residence key? Examine Gallery So we came all this way for a stupid gallery key. Easy, easy, baby. That was not a dream. You were sure that you saw the saw a shotgun. Yep, I got the shotgun right here, man. In fact, let's examine this. Uh, fires 12 gorge shells, A-Stars, Custom Arsenal, and also Richard's favorite. Oh, so it was Richard's shotgun. Okay, this room is green now. We beat this room, baby. Now we go through here. Pick up the magnum rounds. Okay. And <laughs> finds a minigun in said gallery. <laughs> is that what is that is, is that what's in the gallery? Yeah, the minigun. Okay, so B1, this this whole aqua ring place, we, we finished it, man. We finished this place. Now I forgot where the gallery is, man. Oh shit, wrong damn room. I always go in that room for some stupid reason. There we go. Well, it's got to be one of the locked doors on the map. This is it, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is it right here. Discard, of course we discard that, man. I hope there's no zombies in here. Please tell me there's no zombies in here. Ooh, interesting. What's going on here? Ugh, there's bees, ugh! A discard means to throw away, to get rid of.
Now, shall I save it? Yes or no? I've only got, I've only got one ink ribbon left, you know. So I don't know if I'll be able to find any more. <laughs> 64 handgun bullets, baby. That's what I'm talking about. I've been careful with my health, though. But I've not been careful with my ink ribbons. I've got two saves left, actually. Maybe I should save. I don't know, man. I've got mixed feelings about this, man. Should I save? Uh, You know what? I'm going to save, man. Here's the thing, if I, if I need to save my ink ribbons, I can reload this save file and do it all over again. But at least this way, if I save it now, then if I die, I won't have to... I won't have to backtrack so much, because backtracking in this game is so annoying, man. I'm probably going to regret that, actually. I'm probably going to regret saving that. Actually, you know what? Let me go back, get the pistol, use the pistol to kill the bees. <laughs> Sorry for all this back and forth, guys. One hundred percent sure that the doors are the real problem of this game. XDNP. What's XDNP? Is that the name of the mod? I heard that there's a mod that that allows you to skip doors in this game, but I don't know what it's called. Them wasps look nasty, man. Shit. Oh, what? There's more? An assorted... An assortment of old test tubes and flasks. 
lab equipment you've never seen before. Could these have been used for some kind of experiment? It's locked. The door plate reads 003. Hey, get off me, man. A corpse with a contorted expression of pain on his face. He's holding something. Will you take the insecticide spray? Now what is this? Examine this. Pump. Action spray. There's plenty of insecticide inside. It's too dangerous to go any further. XD's a smiley, no problem is no problem. Oh, okay. Now what do I do, man? Hey, get off me. It's blocked from the other side. Great. What do I do? Lock mechanism for the door. Use it. Oh shit, I forgot the numbers, man. What was it? Five, three, eight. Yeah, <laughs> Ritatsky. What's going on, Ritatsky? Yeah, I am kind of lost at the moment, but I'll find my way, man. I'll find my way. I think I've got a clue now. I think I have a bit of a clue. But welcome to the stream, Rutatsky. I've not seen you in the stream before. Let me know what time zone you are from, man. I'm always happy to see and welcome newcomers, you know what I'm saying? This is um, this is a blind run on the hardest available setting at the time, which is normal. Okay, the lamp shines with reddish light. So red, orange, green. I think it was. Yep, that one's green. The lamp shines with green light. It's 12.50 a.m. here. Oh, okay, so you must be in, what, Canada then? No, actually, I'm chatting shit. No, you must be... What, Russia maybe? The lamp shines with orange light. So, three, five, and six. Okay, three, five, and six. Now it's just a question of which way, which order they go in. 17, 14, 49 p.m. for you, Mr. C. For me, the time is 16, 50, so 10 to 5, 10 to 5 p.m. So Mr. C is one hour ahead of me. 
And you seem to be a good 12 hours behind me, Ratatsky. Maybe you're from Japan. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, you're from Japan, aren't you? Yes, I live in England, man. England, yes. London, UK. Okay, three, five, and six. Okay, five, six, and three. Six, three, five. Alright, six, five, three, three, six, five, five, six, three, six, five, three, three, five, six, five, three, six, six, three, five, five, six, three. What the hell? Oh, you gotta select it first. Five, six, three. Okay, five, six, three. Around the Southeast Asia, but you're close. Japan, let me guess. Uh, you from the Maldives. Or maybe Korea. There we go. Whoa. I hate the sound of bees, man. Holy shit. There's something written on the wall. 1 plus 3 equals 4. 4 plus 6 equals 10. 1 plus 6 equals 7. 10 plus 7 equals 17. And 17 plus 3 equals 20. How am I supposed to remember that, man? You don't know much about medicine, but there's no point taking the empty bottle. Yeah, this isn't Zelda, man, where you just take empty bottles and stick fairies in them. <clears throat> you don't know much about medicine, so there's no point taking the empty bottle. Now, so what's in here? We can we open this door for no reason. Are you serious? Insecticide spray. Examine. It's a pump action spray. There's plenty of insecticide inside. So where would I spray it, man? Okay, I'm lost now, man. I am lost hard.
That was useless, man. Or maybe you put it here. There we go. I think I solved it, man. Will you take the residence key? Ugh. Look at this guy's face. Yeah, just about. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh my gosh. A picture of a mansion towering over a forest. Some rolls of wallpaper. Oh look, there's typewriter here. So I didn't need to save, man. I should have waited. An old-fashioned but high-quality bed. There's bats everywhere. Your view is blocked by the dense thicket of trees. The shelf is lined with red books. There's one white book sandwiched in between them. Take it. Organic Chemistry Lab Experiment. The similarities in the cellular characteristics of the rapidly growing plant infected by the tyrant virus have been reported in various papers. However, while repeating these experiments, an interesting new fact became clear. We learned that a chemical in the UMB family, UMB number 20, contains a compound that is toxic to the cells of the plant. We have given UMB number 20 a new name, V-Jolt. If calculations prove correct, when V-Jolt is applied directly to the root of the plant, the entire plant should be dead within 5 seconds. The V-Jolt can be made by simply mixing the VP and UMB chemicals in a specific ratio. However, extra care, extra care must be taken when handling these UMB chemicals. They have been known to generate toxic gases if mishandled. The characteristics of each UMB chemical are as follows. UMB number 3 equals red, U yellow, 6, yellow, UMB number 7 equals green, UMB number 10 equals orange, VPO17 equals blue and VJOLT equals dark brown. So I've got to be a scientist now, yeah? <laughs> yeah, if you guys would like to follow on Twitter as well and YouTube as well and if you would like to join the Discord server the Discord server is available here as well yeah, it looks like I have to go inside here now Oh my gosh, what the hell happened here? The roots of some kind of giant plant are sticking out of the wall. Ugh. The shelves are lined with various soaps and cosmetics. They're all umbrella brand products. Here we go again. We drain the water, something nasty happens.
The tap for the wash bin doesn't seem to be working. There's nothing here. I still have some kind of business in this room, man. Old award certificates line the shelf. Most of them are from the city or the army. Why is this room red, man? I seem to have business in this room. What am I missing? Oh boy. Why is this room red? It's blocked from the other side, but why? I am lost now, man.
Yeah, I think I remember now. I think I remember. The red book. The binding of the book seemed to form some kind of pattern. Reorder the books. a naked woman. Shit. There we go. Wrecked. Oh my gosh, that was a surprise. Holy shit. So let's get this straight, there must be the chemicals around here somewhere. Uh -uh, uh -uh. 
Uh -uh. Red. The door refuses to open. Are you serious, man? So where do I get these chemicals from to feed it to its roots, like? A book is missing. Holy shit. Oh, so this is where you actually... I just need to find the chemicals then. The shelves aligned with various soaps and cosmetics, they're all umbrella brand products. Where are these chemicals, man? That's what I can't find out. Where are the chemicals? Yandere Maiden, what's going on man? How you doing my brother? How's everything? There's that one room that I never went in. Uh. Someone stole a book from the shelf. Okay, I need to find the chemicals to put into the root of the plant. The problem is, where are the chemicals? A run didn't go so good? Oh man. But then again, you you were playing the super hard mode, boy. So, you know. You're gonna encounter more challenges, aren't you? I mean, you were trying to complete the game in one life without... without even healing yourself. That's hard, man. And that's on the hardest setting too as well. Okay, I think my answer lies in this one room that I haven't been in.
I'm trying to find the chemicals to, to kill this plant 42, man. Well, can that actually still hurt you? This is the room that I haven't been in yet, right? It's the snake's fault. <laughs> the locker is completely soaked. There's nothing special inside. What do I do? Or trying to find chemicals. When you do, that's where you need to use it. No, you're supposed to put the chemicals in the root of the plant, according to the document that I picked up. The issue I'm having is where are these chemicals, man? I thought they might be there, but they're not there either. Similarities in the cellular characteristics of the rapidly growing plant infected by the tyrant virus have been reported in previous papers. However, while repeating these experiments, an interesting new fact became clear. We learned that a chemical in the UMB family, UMB number 20, contains a compound that is toxic to the cells of the plant. We have given UMB number 20 a new name, JVOLT. If calculations prove correct when J-Volt is applied directly to the roots of the plant, the entire plant should be dead within 5 seconds. The J-Volt can be made by simply mixing the VP and UMB chemicals in a specific ratio. However, extra care must be taken when handling these UMB chemicals. They have been known to generate toxic gases if mishandled. The characteristics of each UMB chemicals are as follows. UMB3... Red, blah, 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 blah. Hang on a minute. There was only one room that I remember where there was chemicals. And that was in the mansion. And that was in the mansion. In the typewriter item box room on the left. But I, I don't think that's the room though, because the room is green. Oh man, I'm so baffled. Oh, um. <laughs> I am baffled, bruh. We have... Grenada in the stream. Welcome, Grenada. How you doing, man? All right, thank God for that, man. It's in the area I'm in. Okay. I wonder if this shark can actually bite. Chemicals, chemicals, chemicals. Where could they be? Maybe in here. Maybe feed the plant some oil. <laughs> plant 42. Dealt with any passwords recently? Uh, one for a door. I went into that room. Mm. 
but I guess we could try again. What am I doing? There we go. I put the red book on the shelf. I go and see the plant. I come back and the red book is missing, like. So who took the red book, man? Alright, back in the gallery. I can't use any of this equipment here. But, but this is the only room on the map where where the room is red. And I've opened the store. Yeah, I used the red book. something written on the wall, 1 plus 3 equals 4, 4 plus 6 equals 10, blah blah blah. It keeps saying the same stuff, so there's basically nothing in here for me, man. And the room is green as well, which indicates that there's nothing in here for me. Now you see, this is the room where you're supposed to use the chemicals. The proof of that is all the roots are here. Strange stuff, man. See, look. The one of the red books is missing, man. I put it there, like. So who took the red book? A giant plant is crushing the wall. A swarm of angry moths surrounds it. Hmm. I am baffled hard, boy. Uh, no, I haven't tried to fight it. Knowing when I can just feed it chemicals. But I guess I could try to fight it. Since I'm running out of ideas. But I just didn't want to waste my bullets, man. Mm. 
Ugh. This isn't going to work, is it? It's not necessary to use this now. A herb mix of two green herbs was inside. It doesn't look like this is going to work, man. This has to fight Plant 42 regardless, but you can weaken it with the chemical. You only trigger a cutscene if you let Richard die. You gain control of... I just have to fight it. Okay. Wrecked. This isn't gonna work, man. Unless it's scripted that he has to just die. That's just gay, man. Oh my gosh. Now where was I? I don't even know where I was now.
we should be able to go straight back to boss. Nope, I've got to do this shit. I should take care of these Muppets. And it doesn't help that I didn't get the actual Magnum, man. But if you look on the map here, for the mansion, you will see that those three rooms in the upper right of the map uh that's where you that's where you do the whole um B thing and then that's where you, you you use the medallion in the in the courtyard if in the red box at the bottom of the bottom right of the courtyard map to get the uh the magnum What do you mean it's not necessary to use this right now? I've got to take this out, that's why. There we go. OVB Fresh, what's going on my brother? How you doing man? Welcome back to the stream. How is everything? I'm struggling here with Resident Evil right here man. How are you? How is the Kirby man? Are you, are you still vacuuming up all your enemies in Kirby? I'm good, my brother, man. What have you been up to? I'm having a hard time getting past this guy right here. You're just at work? <laughs> Sucking up enemies for day. <laughs> A book is missing. Ugh. So 
how would I fight this thing, man? I'm like stuck here, like. Portion already, man. We can reload here, I think. That was a wasted bullet. Uh, this don't look so good. Really? Really? You watch speedruns this this all the time? You never seen a casual though, yeah? We seem to be making some kind of progress. There was some kind of cutscene going on there. We have Smash Fiend. What's going on, man? Smash Fiend, how are you doing? Examine. Use that, we are fine, baby. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Plant sucks. You're just a bit tired. I'm tired of fighting this plant, man. This plant is annoying. Ugh, shit, the vomit is real, boy. Yeah, man, roll up that raccoon herb. Roll that spliff. Spun that herb, man. <laughs> Plant is easy, are you sure? Because I'm having a damn hard time here, man. I'm going in circles, like. Oh, pissed! Man, just knocked me off the balcony, like. Maybe we should go here. Ugh, ugh. This is not good. The fresh did this man just ask? <laughs> This plant looks nasty though, still like. Oh no, you can't be serious, man. You speed smash free and you speed run this game on a very high level. How how long have you been speed running this game for? I 
fifth. You've been bopped. Ooh. Maybe I should use the other shotgun, man. Maybe the self-defense gun. Maybe I should try that. Definitely gonna need the book, though. A few months, if not close to a year now. A few months to a year. Oh my gosh, man. That's a long time still. How'd you do it, man? Speedrunning the same game over and over and over again. Don't you get bored? It must takes a lot of mental stamina, man. Maybe three years. Oh, I see you. You were trying to... You, you don't anymore. You got burnt out? Yeah, I can imagine, man. I can imagine seriously playing the same game over and over again. That's tiring, man. It's partly why I don't speedrun. Because I just get bored. And on top of that, I have too many games to play, man. For me to be investing my time in speedruns. And also, like, the, the, another thing about speedrunning is, is people just tend to glitch the game, man. Like, not in every game, but you do, do get those games where people just glitch the holy hell out of the game. Oh yeah, I noticed you speedrunning Resident Evil 2, man. I was there on, in one of your previous streams. I've seen two or three of your, your, your Resident Evil 2 streams, man. Some good shit there. You just hate resetting so far in? Now speedrunning in general is, is pretty tedious and time consuming man. It's for people, but it makes sense for people who don't have many games though. If you've got very few games then speedrunning would probably, would probably suit you in that sense. I'm not a fan of all this backtracking man. I've read this already. Put this in. You haven't been engaged, you haven't been speedrunning Resident Evil for that long. Do you enjoy the hype factor of VB? I don't know man, I don't, I don't really see the hype in speedrunning. So, sometimes speedrunning can, can, can produce like swaggy moments and those swaggy moments can be fun. But besides that, the, the process, the overall process of having those moments is too time consuming man. Now here we go now. Wow, Spitfire straight away as soon as I climb the stairs. Ugh. What? If this continues, we ain't gonna last too long. A 
like to you speedrunning is no different than playing League of Legends over and over again but I don't play League of Legends for the same reason it's grindy man you know what I mean it gives you a chance to play your old favorite games in a new way no but CSGO is actively competitive though so even though it's 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 the same right it's like you, you're competing in aim shit I just wasted that didn't I great and I, I don't lose the gun oh my gosh Oh, really, man? What's this? It looks like you gotta shoot it when it's exposed, though. I have no idea what I'm doing, man. It's not exposed. How do I get it exposed? There we go. Boom. What's it doing? How many how many hits do I have to give this damn thing, man? I don't want to waste too many bullets on it. This plant keeps raining poison. Look at this. Look at all the Spitfire. Oh, really? Some of the grogginess in this game. Ugh. Back up the stairs. This is tight, man. I know that when I call down there, it opens its face. Great. Did we beat it? Oh yes, we beat it, yes! GG, yeah. What's this? Will you take the mansion key? Oh my gosh, all of this way for the mansion key. Examine, which one is this? There's an engraving of a helmet. Nice fight. You scared me. You, you took okay? the book. <laughs> you yeah, naughty girl. It's dead. But Richard, he's gone. Oh, he was destined to die anyway, man. Forget about that guy. I'm sorry. It's my fault. I should have watched out for him. 
found a pharmaceutical room. I think I can come up with something useful. I'll be there. I'm glad you're still okay. Okay, I'm in danger now. So this room is green, that room is green. All green now, yeah? That's what I like to see. I guess she's in here, hiding in here. Maybe she can heal me up. This room is equipped with all sorts of medical supplies. Want me to treat your wounds? Oh, yes, please, baby. Yeah, would you? Thanks. <laughs> Shit, why is she crying for? Be strong, Rebecca. That sounded like some fake cry, bro. Did you see that? Like, she just pretended to cry, like, and then looked up at him. Right, which way we're we going now? Oh boy, man, that's a relief, man. I got the mansion key. Oh shit, Wesker. You're alive. My words exactly. Where's Jill? Thought you were with her. Yeah, I know. We got separated. I see. Anyway, we better find a way out of here before we turn into zombie food. Got any suggestions, Wesker? We should get a better grip on the situation. There must be areas still to be explored in that other mansion. Chris, I want you to check them out one more time. I'll continue my investigation here. Sure thing. Wow, that guy seems ice cold, man. Still need more ink ribbons. I've only got one ink ribbon left, man. I hope I find some more, you know. I don't want to go out there and end up dying like then I get set back all over again They may come in handy, who knows. <clears throat> now time to head back to the mansion, boy. Pff, 
This is gonna be a long way back. Oh shit, we need the crank, don't we? In order to get back to the mansion. Shit, I forgot about that, man. Oh, that crank is so annoying, man. Serious. Krista Brad, can you hear me? Brad. Damn. Oh my gosh, where did the dog come from? Like, really? And snakes here? Oh, wow. Ouch. Doesn't look like we need to go back there anytime soon. Shit, that was close, boy. Them dogs are mean. Oh, look. Items, baby. Oh, yeah. You use this to protect yourself from that monster in chains. That can't be hurt by guns. I also fix the doorknob to make sure you can get away. Oh, are you serious? I get the feeling I'm gonna have to come back for that later, boy. What a helmet. Okay, so there's one key there, one key there. Seems to me that we're approaching the end of the game. 
I think. <laughs> oh boy. What the, what the hell? Oh my gosh, you cannot be bloody serious. What the hell is this? Whoa! They're everywhere. Nah, come on, nah, come on, this is raw. There's not just one of them, there's like multiples of them, like holy shit, what are they? Get off me man, I ain't got time for this. That's like every zombie's turned into one of those lizard things. <laughs> okay, what's in here? I've been wondering what's behind this door for a long time. Let's see. Okay, an elaborately fashioned globe. There's something handwritten, it's not dated. Nothing's changed, I never thought that this room I designed as an experiment would pay off like this. I can hide here safely for a while, because nobody knows about the secret behind this painting, not even Sir Spencer. Painting of a mansion, in the back of the art room. Could this be a telescope? It looks to be pretty old. What's this? There's some kind of internal organ inside. You can't tell whether it came from a human or an animal. There's some kind of... Ugh. Will you take the ink ribbon? Three, yes. Hmm. I hope this is some kind of save room or something. No, 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 no. Oh, you can't be serious, man. Oh, oh my gosh. Like, really? Okay, man, I'm burnt out on this. Uh, thank you everyone for uh, stopping by the stream. I'm going to be ending this particular session of this particular game. I hope you enjoyed the show. I'm your host, Ultimate Meal 420. Uh, le let me pass it on to somebody, man. Thanks, Smash Fiend. Many thanks for camping my stream. I'm going to be hosting I Tragedy. Keep losing my host button, man. 
Here we go. Send him the host, man. <laughs> 